In this video, we're going to go through a couple of examples of writing these in the form of 2 to the power of k, so 2 to the power of something. So what you want to do with question number 1 is to look at what you have, and you've got the root 2, so you can write that as 2 to the power of 1 half. And in the denominator, we've got 4 cubed. Now, 4 is 2 squared, so I'm going to write that as 2 squared cubed. So I'll leave the numerator alone. 2 squared cubed is 2 to the power of 6, because the 2 and the 3 multiply. And now we have 2 to the power of 1 half take away 6. So 1 half take away 6 is minus 11 halves. And now that is in the format that we want. So for question number 2, 8 to the power of 4 times 2 over the cube root of 16. So 8 we know is 2 cubed. So 2 cubed, and that's to the power of 4. Times by, well we've got 2 to the power of 1 if you like. You can put the 1 there. And 16 is 2 to the power of 4, and that's being cube rooted. So 2 to the power of 4 is the 16. The cube root is the same as writing that to the power of a third. So let's tidy this up. We've got 2 to the power of 12 times by 2 to the power of 1 over 2 to the power of 4 thirds. Now I'm going to leave the 2 to the power of 12 as it is and deal with this fraction first. We have 1 take away 4 thirds is minus a third, so 2 to the power of minus a third. So then we have 12 plus minus a third. So 12 take away a third is 35 thirds. So 2 to the power of 35 thirds is what we want. 